1975. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta go on TV. Put hold them on. on hold. Just take Sorry, a bite out right of it. Right there. All right. 1975. People celebrated the Rampart Range, Sertoma Territory Days Parade, and Buffalo Barbecue. Well, 39 years later, I'm so glad that they just call it Territory Days now, <laughs> and it attracts 100,000 people every year. Yeah, today, Travis Ruiz live in old Colorado City, where all the action is taking place this weekend. Good morning, Trav. Yeah, these streets will be absolutely packed tomorrow, Sunday, Monday. It is Territory Days. We're so excited about it. And joining me here now is Nelson Roseland. He's a past president of Old Colorado City Association. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Good morning. Thanks for, Thanks with for us. being yeah. down here. Absolutely. So tell me a little bit about Territory Days. Well, it's, it started out as a celebration of, of our first territorial capital, and it has grown into the largest outdoor event in southern Colorado. And this year we have over 200 vendors, over 100 crafters, handmade awesome. items, um, more than 20 of which are, are new to us this year. Um, we've added a four stage for uh, performance venues. We've got over 27 performing groups, um, and it's really exciting. So you mentioned more than 200 vendors. What kind of vendors are these? Well, primarily the, the main thrust is the crafters, uh -huh. uh, but then there are a mix of nonprofits and, and commercial vendors as well. Food vendors, including restaurateurs from the city, as well as um, turkey legs and, and fun carnival stuff and that sort of thing as well. How long have you been a part of Territory Days? This will be my eighth year. Okay. So how have you seen it kind of change over the last eight years? Well, since uh, Pro Promotions came on as the event promoters, um, it's actually taken on, um, I'd say, a more professional air. Um, it's still a great street festival, but they brought um, professionalism to it that we didn't have before. That's really awesome. Grateful. Tell me what people can expect this year that is different from years prior. Uh, the, fourth, the fourth performing venue, we've got three Native American groups, uh, including Brule, uh, and they're, they're rotating through the, the, entire, uh, the, the entire event schedule. Jake Loggins' band will be back. Um, really cool people. So just so much fun. And of course, like we were talking earlier, parking is going to be kind of an issue. So what can people do as far as parking? Well, we, we ask everyone to be respectful of not only the businesses down here, but the folks who live in the neighborhood. We've got free parking at Coronado High School and Rockledge Ranch with uh, free shuttles running around the clock. Um, we'll be open for business 10 to 7 Saturday and Sunday and 10 to 6 on Monday. Awesome. So really it's kind of fun for the whole family. There's, Absolutely. So what kind of activities for, for the kids? Um, there's gold panning. There'll be um, shootout demonstrations, blacksmithing. Clint will have his horse here, uh, authentic teepee with relics that they can examine, um, folks in period costume. Um, so a lot, of, a lot of culture, a lot of fun, a lot Absolutely. of music and food. Absolutely. Got lots of food vendors, right? Indeed. Yeah. And so right now we're in front of what is this? This is the oldest, the longest the running business in the historic district. Nice and naughty. Yeah. It's uh, been here, I think, 31 or 32 years, uh, longer than anyone else in the historic district. Wow. So 31 years in old Colorado City. So she's, that's a long she's time. Seen a lot. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. So, and of course, it runs right here in old Colorado City, all the way from 23rd Street all the way down to 27th Street. Right. People will be all over this. So get here early, 10 to 7. That's tomorrow. Sunday and of course on Monday on Memorial Day. So, so much fun here at Territory Days, guys. All right, thanks so much. So much to do, so much to see, and great to support that community down there too, all those local businesses. That's what they call us a lot of times, nice and naughty. You know I, I mean? am the nice one. That's, I, that's, that's <laughs> what I'm saying. I'm the one who always is getting in trouble for doing stuff. So. All right, remember, it starts tomorrow and runs through Monday. Admission totally free. Here's the deal. We know this. If, if, you, if you just move in here, if you've never gone to Territory Days, don't go down there and try to park. Park at Coronado High School or Rockledge Ranch. They have free shuttles that go all day. Leave your car there and then just pack up and have a good time out there. I can't wait for my turkey leg. Mm -hmm. I can't wait for my funnel cake. Yep. I can't wait for all the fun stuff. All the stuff. candy, all oh, the good stuff. My goodness. All the live entertainment, fun. too. Mm. All right, 88.